Alrighty, folks, it's VB7200. Today, I'm covering the snowstorm that we got hit with today. Yeah, uh, today is March 7, no, 14th, 2017. Um, and we got a pretty big snowstorm. Uh, this big, uh, I was outside actually. Well, this plow's slowing down right there. I don't know if you can see it or not. But uh, basically, last night, there was, I was outside until about 5.30 in the morning, and it was just starting to snow, and it's now, oh, is that a car in the ditch down there? I can't really see. That's a bad corner down there, so there might be something off the road, but I can't really tell. It's pretty much whiteout conditions. I wish I had my wheeler up and running because I would take it down the road because in New York you can do that when it's like this. You can ride whatever you want on the road and no, no one's going to give you crap usually because there's no troopers out that are just patrolling unless you go down to like an accident or something. <coughs> but the snow is to my mid-thigh, so right about here, and I'm about six foot. So we've got about two and a half feet of snow in the course of 12 hours, which is ridiculous. Um, if I go walking in it, this is above my boots, and I have like, and this is matted down a little bit. And what I want to do is run back because we had a fire last night, that's why I was out so late. And the fire went, it was, we had a pretty good bed of coals going. So I'm wondering how it is back there, how much of the snow is actually melted. There's a bird. So I'm going to see if I can make it back there. It, the snow falls ridiculous. This is, any, I don't even think this is a lake effect. Usually lake effect is what hits us really hard up here. But I think this came from the south. We had that going maybe an hour ago and it ran out of gas. We snow blowed this, like I said, an hour ago and it's already up to my boots again. Yeah, that's this is the garage. Um, I got a shovel soon. I don't. I gotta get a shovel. I don't know what my brother do with the shovel, but I guess we can take a truck down there. Put my hands in my pockets. This is to my knees right now. You can see that to my knees. We have Superintendent's Day Thursday, which is a day from today. So, well, today's Tuesday, so we got a day in between to clear some of this out. I'm gonna have to come back here with a snow blower and kind of clear everything up. My friend has a snowmobile. I don't have one. I was just this is literally this is to my thighs right now that I'm standing in. And again, this is over the course of a little under 12 hours. Like 11 and a half, maybe. Making my way downtown. The reason why I said I'm curious of this is because this back here is, like I said, we had a fire going. I'd like to see um, how much of it, oh, I still see it actually smoking. Wow, that's pretty cool. This is very taxing on the body because you gotta trudge through all the snow. Not that I'm cold. I really honestly can't even feel how cold it is. I'm only in sweatpants. But it's just, you gotta move all of it with your body. Oh yeah, I see it smoking still. Now it's about to my waist. I just fell a little there. Oh yeah.
That's still going. I'm gonna warm my hands up a little bit. But yeah, it's still going. That's pretty cool. But as you can see, that's a chair right there. It's just ridiculous. Well, hope you like this quick update on the blizzard we're going through out here. Thanks for watching. I'll have some more stuff happens. We're supposed to get snow for a while, so we'll see.